Hey, assalamualaikum everyone. So welcome back to the Luna Classic update today. And right now, Luna Classic is still doing quite good and holding itself really, really better against Bitcoin. So Bitcoin had a Wyckoff distribution, but it wasn't as worse as we thought it's going to be. Bitcoin is dropping, but altcoins are getting money. All right. What does that mean? Well, basically what that means is that we saw Bitcoin pumping like crazy, making new all-time highs and all these other altcoins. I mean, like, uh, lo look at Luna Classic, right? It's very far away from the all-time high, which was uh, back here a few, you know, a couple of months ago. You made it all the way up to 58,000 and right now you're sitting at 9,900, right? So you still have a long way to go all the way back up to the all-time highs 457 percent move up okay and I, was, I, I spoke about Luna Classic before and I've told you that there is this pattern that is identical where you had a you know channel to the downside you broke up and then you started to move to the upside so whatever you're looking right over here this thing is almost the same as if it's actually here right over there okay and very soon enough you may see something like this one more time and you may see something like that one more time because well signs are there you have a nice bullish divergence look at this right this is a clear sign of a divergence this is good this is good and keep in mind i am in a trade of luna classic i have bought luna classic at ten thousand, pretty much at where the prices are right now and i bought it when bitcoin was at funny funny stuff is that bitcoin was sitting at sixty seven thousand dollars and that's when i bought luna classic and now bitcoin is sitting at fifty seven fifty eight thousand and Luna Classic is still almost at the very same place that I entered. So there hasn't been too much uh, price changes. Another thing is, if I show you the daily time frame, the daily suggests that this is the best uh, buying place for Luna Classic. That's your lowest oversold level, and you're also sitting right over there. So imagine the next departure is almost up back here. So whether it happens by the middle of May, by the next month in June, whatever okay this is almost like a swing trade so it's not going to come in very very quickly i personally think it's a swing trade on the daily time frame you have a candle that shows reversal which is this dragonfly doji right here so you may see a push up for luna classic finally break above and go to the upside even bitcoin is looking to push back up to 60k one more time and maybe eventually drop down 52 you never know but i think that it's a no-brainer for me and I told you in the previous video it's a 50-50 kind of uh, purchase right now so I do have 50% purchased here which means if I have a thousand dollars I'm getting five hundred dollars right over here and if Luna Classic somehow you never know about crypto but if somehow Bitcoin goes and drop and we see Luna Classic dropping down to maybe you know five thousand again I take another 500, I put it here, I've took one, I've put it here, and I'm going to average out on a 72, 7500 level. And if Luna Classic goes back up again, well, that's another win. So it's just a little bit of a strategy that you have learned just now. And that's all for the video, and I'm going to see you in the next one of the office.